my friend Urso. Defying rays that support the sky city. And we're safe? As King Vulcan's prisoner, our chances are slim. We are better acquainted. Take your hands off of me. You decline the honor of becoming my queen? I did not know your highness was in the ship. My father will send an army to destroy you and your entire city. Not while I hold his beautiful daughter hostage. You would dare to make me a prisoner? Shall we say, uh, yes? <laughs> so you're the Flash I've heard so much about. Yes, I'm the fellow. What about it? I need a strong man like you. Prince Baron, welcome. Who is the elderly Earthman? Dr. Zarkov, a great scientist, Your Highness. I have need for a great scientist. Guard, take Dr. Zarkov to my laboratory and remove his bond. And the strong young man to the furnace room, where he will be kept warm. You can't do this, Your Majesty. No? Maybe you do not wish to be separated from your friend. You shall go with him. Release those men, Bolton, or I'll... Don't annoy me. Guard, take them away. Did you find any trace of my daughter of the Earth people? Yes, Your Majesty. We discovered a Hawkman who had been injured in a fight with the Earthman Gordon. He told us that Chris Thun and the Earth Girl had been taken as prisoners to King Bolton's city. Where Bolton, no doubt, will compel the Earth Girl to marry him. It is a habit of his. But what are the others? The Princess Aura and Flash Gordon were found by Dr. Zarko and Prince Baron. Barony? I thought that treacherous pretender would interfere. They have gone in pursuit of the others in Prince Baron's rocket ship. Prepare my rocket fleet at once. We will go to the sky city of Bolton and teach him a needed lesson.
they got you, Flash. There's no escape from this inferno. There must be some way out of this place, huh? Don't strike him, Flash! activity in this laboratory is quite strong. Yes. My city is supported by the gravity-resisting rays thrown out by the atom furnace, Dr. Sarko. I understand. But what if something should happen to your furnace? What if your supply of radium fuel becomes exhausted? It would mean complete destruction. A new substitute must be found. It will be your task to discover this new force. That's why I spared you from the furnaces. Spared me? You mean that my friends are... They are feeding radium to the atom furnaces and will continue to do so until you discover this new force. The radium will kill them. It's a very pleasant death. To your task, my friend. It's up to you. I must warn you. Flash Gordon's life depends upon your attitude toward King Bolton. What do you mean? Convince Bolton you do not care for Flash. Oh, I couldn't do that. Just as I thought. You care more for yourself than you do for Flash. No, that's not true. Then prove it. How? Give him up. You're the cause of all his trouble. That's not true. I'd do anything for Flash. Tell Bolton you love him. And I can save Flash. If you give him up, I can make him a king. If you do not, he will pay for your selfishness with his life. All right. I will. You do not eat, my little duck. Not hungry? And you don't enjoy my entertainers? Solomon. thinking of the Earth Man. Oh, no, Your Majesty. She confessed to me she liked you very much. Is that not true? Yes, Your Majesty. It's just as I told you, Bolton. The Earth Woman finds the men of Bongo more attractive than the men of her own planet. My little dog.
Mutiny in the furnace room. You're Earth. But he cannot escape. Come, I'll show you. No matter what you see, don't betray your feelings. If anyone moves, you'll all be destroyed. It's no use, Flash. Get back! No use! Faint. She did not eat enough dinner. Come, take her to the throne room. Bring the Earthman up to me. strong as you thought you were. Strong enough to tear you apart. <laughs> Maybe you're right. Still looking for trouble, huh? Take him to the static room. That'll tame him. Yes, Your Majesty. Come on, move! You miserable little coward. You hadn't grit enough to save the man you love. They struck him. I couldn't stand it. What happens to him now will make those whiplashes seem like love pats. Did you kill Flash? No, not yet. Your Majesty must pardon me. I was overcome by the heat of the furnace room. Or was it because of Flash Gordon? I have been told that you love him. That was before I met Your Majesty. You will have to prove that. You doubt my word? Come. Beyond this room, I will know the truth. 